Hey guys, welcome to my channel and in today's video we're going to be drawing Kevin McAllister from Home Alone. So I've got a pencil outline and I'm going to teach you how to do it. So you're going to start with drawing two circles in the centre of your page. I, use, I trace around a small circle because I suck at doing circles. They're going to be this. They've got to be the exact same size. So if you want to trace around an object too, you can. And then we're going to go. I'm going to zoom. And then we're going to do the white bit of the eye and both eyes exactly the same place, like that. And then the black bit of the eye. Just curve like that and then connect to the white bit of the eye. Then do the same for the other eye. And then let's colour no, the black bit in black. She's a now, if you feel like I'm going too fast, you can pause the video to catch up at any time or you can go back to a certain point and re-watch it if you want to just see what I did again. So now let's draw the eyebrows. So you want to go uh, stay on the top of the eye and just draw a trick out and then curve at the top connecting them both together. Now let's make this one a little bit higher. You want to curve up and then curve down to connect them together like that. Now let's draw the nose. You want to do a little curve coming like that. And then a smaller curve going this way like this. Let's draw the mouth. So what you want to do is you want to just draw a line like this and a little flick at the top. And then do a line of cup curve and the curve and then you have the mouth now I'll just add his hair so you want to draw no let's do the bottom of his face so you want to start curving down and around and back up just past just up to his eye Now you want to add his hair, so you're just going to curve up, then curve down and stop, then curve back, go straight up, then curve down and then go back up. Now we want to curve the other way and you're going to curve out like that, then curve back up and then stop just there. Then you want to curve down to the eyebrow and then just straight diagonal line up. Then curve down past the eyebrow and then curve up. Then you want to curve down connecting those two lines. Now we're going to add his hair. So you're going to go up and then curve like that and then down to curve. And then you're going to go out, curve out and then, and then curve in to there. Then you want to curve out this way, curve back down, and then curve up and round, and then stop, and then bring it in, then bring it out, curve out and into there. Now we want to add the ears to the side of his face, so you want to stop here, curve down, and then curve like this. And do the same on the other side so you can make the hair in the ear. You want to add two flicks onto the inside. Then that's the face done. So now we want to do the neck. So you want to curve out and stop and up for there. Then you want to add two arms here. You want to do two lines going down like this and then do a curve up and across like that does that make sense yeah okay now we want to add a strap so you want to go all the way down to here 
and then do it all the way down to here. Right, let's draw a curve here, draw this down to the heel and this down to the heel. And let's make a shoe and we've got the curve up so go cross and curve up and then stop then curve down and do the same. Now we want to make a big sole so you want to go like that and curve. Now we want to make the thumb. You want to curve up the round and stop here. And then do the same on the other side. Do the same on the other like I said, the same on the other side. But flip it that way. Now we want to add three fingers. So you just do small little ovals like this, and then the same on this side, three little ovals like this. Then we want to add the bottom of the gun. So you want to come down and up to connect to the thumb, to the finger, and the same down and up, connect, attach to the finger. Then put the back of the hand, back of the hand, and then connect that to the top to make his little arm. And then down here we have his trousers, so you want to draw two curved lines like that, and then a curved line like this. Now we want to draw the top of the gun fin. You want to draw a curved line, and another curved line coming, and then you want to come inwards like oh wait. Was like that maybe I should zoom out a bit there we go and then you want to draw an oval and another curve line like that and then a curve line like that now we want to do the same we want to just curve up and curve like that and then do another oval Now we have two guns. Now we want to do that big gun fin that he has. But first we want to connect the little fins to the back onto his shoe. So you want to do that. And then you want to do this. So then there are the two little wires attached to that. And then what we want to do is a straight diagonal line. And then one just slightly up higher than the strap if I zoom in. Slightly higher than the strap. And then just do a line connecting that. And then if we come here, we just want to do two lines connected with each other and then a line there. And then you want to add some camo to it. You can add some camo to a strap. And there you go, that's the drawing of Kevin McAllister. Now let's colour him in. So let's just get the pen that I just used and we're going to colour in this bit this is a black hole the same with this side now they're two they're going to be two different coloured guns two different colours this is going to be red and that can be
colour as well. Whatever colour you think will look good for his lips. But I think this is all complete. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Goodbye.